Hi everyone, it's Robin Powell and today we're going to be talking about Go Woe and Slow Beverages. You know, we've talked uh, in previous videos about the importance of keeping your body balanced and part of that balance is ensuring that we're filling ourselves with the proper beverages. Most people, you know, you know there's coffee, tea, fruit juices, orange juice, milk, soda, but the most important one is water, but we'll get to that in a little bit later. Most juices contain a lot of sugar. So if you look at the nutrition labels, which we've talked about in previous videos, if that's what we should be looking at, you'll see that there's not a lot of 100% juice out there. So it's filled with fructose syrup. There's added sugars that make it really bad for your teeth. It can cause you to gain weight. You can get diabetes. So those are gonna be kind of our slow or woe beverages that you know it's on that list that you don't really wanna have a lot of those because it's not good for your body. On the other hand, soda tea and coffee those contain caffeine um, and caffeine really can cause you to be jittery um, you can stay up at night it can cause you to be irritable it can cause you to be cranky um, and some people can even uh, get headaches from having too much caffeine so those are the beverages that are really going to be the slow beverages that we want to stay away from because they're not going to be beneficial for your body so what is the Go Beverage? The Go Beverage is water. Water really is the best beverage you can have that's out there for your body. It's gonna keep your body balanced. It has minerals, it has nutrients, it has no sugar and it has no caffeine. So there's nothing but benefits for drinking water. You really wanna be aiming to get six to eight glasses of water every single day. And remember, right, if you're exercising like we're supposed to be exercising for 20 or 30 minutes a day, you can have water after that. If it's a really hot day, you can have water. You can put water in a water bottle. Um, you can buy water. You can get water from your refrigerator, from your um, faucet, if you, you know. So there's always a place or somewhere to get water. Schools have waters, malls, stores, everywhere you can get water. So that's the go beverage. That's what we should be aiming to drink. It's really going to be best for your body. So remember, we want to limit sugary drinks. We want to look at nutrition labels if we are going to be buying drinks out there to make sure we're getting the best possible ones that's going to have the best nutrients for our body. Remember, we still want to exercise 20 to 30 minutes a day and at best try and get six to eight glasses of water a day to keep your body balanced. Have a good one.